slightly flat at the top and bottom. Who proved that earth is round? Yes. Ferdinand Magellan proved that earth is round. Now we have to study about the face of the earth. Earth is so big. So we cannot see all the places at a time. So we need a small model of the earth. The small model of the earth is known as globe. Even on a globe, we cannot see all the places at a time. We have to rotate it. And globe is very difficult to carry with us. So we use map. Map is a flat drawing of the earth surface on a flat on a paper. And a book of map is known as Atlas. Now we will see more about globes and maps. The earth is so big that we cannot see all the places on it at the same time. We need a smaller model of the earth to understand how it looks. A globe is a model of the earth. It is round and shows land and water. But even on a globe, we can only see half of the earth at a time. We need to rotate it to see the other half. It is also difficult to show every place on a, on a globe. So we use map. A map is a flat drawing of the earth. We can draw maps of the entire earth or a part of it. A map is light and easy to handle. We can carry it with us. A book of maps is called an atlas. A map can be big or small. Three-fourths of the earth's surface is covered by water. The large amount of water on the surface of the earth is make it appear blue. So, the earth is known as the blue planets. There are five oceans in the world. The Pacific Ocean is the largest ocean. The Arctic Ocean is the smallest one. Now, let us see which are the other oceans. In the map of the world, the main blue parts are very large water bodies. They are called oceans. There are five oceans in the world. They are the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Arctic Ocean and the Antarctic Ocean. The Pacific Ocean is the largest ocean and the Arctic Ocean is the smallest one. Atlantic's the name of an ocean Pacific and Indian too The Arctic is often forgotten I can name the oceans, can you?
these are the new words of this lesson you have to write it in the notebook you have to write the name of the lesson and the face of the earth and the new words globe map atlas continents directions this is the worksheet and you have to write answer these questions into your notebook you have to write the question and answer also question is what is a globe and what is a map you have to write both of these questions answer in your notebook